All right. So next position is going to be on how to maintain the back control, right? So we learn how to take the back. Now once we're on the back, he's going to look to get to the weak side to do his defense and escapes. How do we maintain it once we're starting to get, get moved around and losing our, our original position? So we're going to go over three drills and movements that will kind of flow through that allow us to always get back to that correct control and not let us get stuck in the guard or loose position. So originally we're here, I did a good job. I went to the strong side, I got a good underhook, I'm pulling in tight, I'm leaning over here, I'm attacking the guy. He's gonna put himself to the weak side, so he'll toe off. Ah. All right, so we're here, he put me on the underhook side, I, it's hard, it's hard to do those dominant chokes from here. So now I'm having some issues from the trouble now. So here what I can do is I can make this side into the strong side. First thing is the hand control. I need to switch my hands. I'm going to grab his hand first here, control it, so that he can't attack the hook, right, to get out. I control the hand. Now I'm going to switch this one and grab the hand control. Pull it back. Control. Now swiftly, tight hooks, pull up and then reach over and sw switch the hand control and get to the old one. That alone will be able to make my switch from a weak, uh, weak side back control to a overhook strong side back control. And again, if he starts to attack my feet and he's doing, he's working both feet, that means he doesn't feel anything upstairs, I'm not being a threat. I simply want to get nice and tight and focus on the top shoulder. He's leaning forward, attacking those feet, I, I, I just start stretching him out and cross-stretching him slightly in control. And controlling his hand for get, getting in there. So that was the first one. We just switching from over under with our hands. Weak side. I'm here. He forced me over here. He has his chin down. He's defending the chokes. Looking to attack the feet. First thing I do is control the hands. Underhook this side. Pull this out. Dive. Grab the wrist, control the nice and tight. If he still attacks my feet, I need to attack his face a little bit and, and stretch him out of my hooks and then right away start getting in here for the neck to be more offensive from the chokes. 